Welcome back to Click Academics. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to solve this exponential expression. So we have 1 plus the square root of 5 over 2 to the power of 12. Now, what I'm first going to do is I'm going to set the variable x equal to what's in the parentheses, meaning 1 plus the square root of 5 over 2. So now if this is true, I'm going to multiply by 2 on both sides, meaning 2x is equal to 1 plus square root of 5. So now if I subtract by 1 on both sides, I get 2x minus 1 is equal to square root of 5. And now if I square both sides, two X minus one squared, well, that's four X squared minus four X plus one. And this is equal to the square root of 5 squared is simply just 5. Now, if I want to bring the 5 to the other side, I'm going to subtract by 5 on both sides, meaning I get 4x squared minus 4x minus 4 equals 0. And now if I divide or sorry, if I factor out 4 from this, because all the coefficients are 4, I get x squared minus x minus 1. And this is equal to 0. So now, if I add x and 1 on both sides, I get x squared equals x plus 1. And now I'm going to take the power of 6 on both sides. So x to the power of 2 times 6 is x to the power of 12. And this is equal to x plus 1 to the power of 6. Now, I could actually rewrite this as x plus 1 squared to the power of 3. And x plus 1 squared is x squared plus 2x plus 1. And this is still to the power of 3. Now remember, we already defined x squared as x plus 1. So if we plug in x plus 1 for x squared, we would get, if we add all the like terms, 3x plus 2 to the power of 3. Now this is equal to 3x plus 2 squared times 3x plus 2. Now, 3x plus 2 squared is equal to 9x squared plus 12x plus 4. 
and this is still multiplying with 3x plus 2. Now again, if we substitute in x squared for x plus 1, sorry, for x squared, this would simplify into 21x plus 13. And this is still multiplying with 3x plus 2. And now if we multiply these two, we would get 63x squared plus 42x plus 39x plus 26. And now I'm actually going to rewrite this as 63x plus 63 plus 42x plus 39x plus 26. All I did was I substituted in x plus 1 for x squared again. Now this can be simplified to 144x plus 89. And remember how we said x was equal to 1 plus the square root of 5 over 2. So now if we plug this in for x, we would get this is equal to 72 plus 72 root 5 plus 89. And this is actually equal to 161 plus 72 root 5. And this is actually the most this can be simplified in. So this is our answer. Mm -hmm.